Okay, so first thing I want to say is I'm sorry about the mic quality. It's going to be terrible, but um, this is a tutorial on Element 3D text and animating it. So make a new composition. I don't know, 1080p, 60fps. That's got to be at 60fps if you ever want to pre-render. And um, make a new text. Make it say, I don't know anything, whatever you want it to say, and make it bigger because you don't want your text to be like super small. And choose on um, the font, any font. I'm gonna choose the basic font because, you know, savage. Um, make it bold, I don't know. And then make a new solid. You want it to be black, it can't be gray. Now go to your effects and presets. Type in element. Okay, and when your element is loaded in, you wanna take that, like the little eye right there, you wanna click that and then go back to this and click custom layers, text and masks, and then tutorial, and then just undo that so it's clean I guess, I don't know, and then click scene setup and wait for the thing to load in. Okay, and when it's loaded in, there's not gonna be anything there, and I don't know, if it doesn't run it might be your graphics card or your version, and then you click extrude, and it makes it 3D. And the bevel makes it like that, like thicker and longer, I guess. I don't know what to call it. And you can make it bigger with the scale. But I just, I put on, um, I can't get on um, materials for some reason, so I put chrome on it. And then environment, and choose one of these pictures. I suggest like this one. This one's pretty cool. And then click OK, and then like, see it's like flashy, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, that's, if you want to, you can put like a chessboard and size it up and then put your text on it, but I'm just going to show you like the basic how to animate your text like that, I don't know. I might make a tutorial on how to like animate it onto things, but I don't know, 20 likes, and then click OK, and then you'll see your text. If you don't see it, go click group one, click particle replicator or whatever it is, and then it's either... Yeah, it's this. Like, you might have to drag it out or in to see your text. Um, and now, animating it, you go to rotation, click, I think it's your Y and your X axis, and you're gonna, like, wanna make your, like, this thing your composition, as long as you want your text to, like, move. And I'm gonna make that, like, 10 seconds. So, you go back to the beginning of the thing, and then. I don't know, you can put it like that and that, and then go all the way to the end, and put it at the opposite of that, like 46 and 7 negative 46, and then 7 negative 33, 33, and then it moves across it, if you can see that, I don't know, yeah, see it moves across, and yeah, that's about it, and then you just click Add to render queue and render it, and that's about it, and see you next time.